A new way to attack an old problem at Kirtland Air Force Base. Millions of gallons of fuel that seeped underground for years. Well, as News 13's Jessica got there reports, the new fuel removal system is almost 20 times as effective as the old system. Behind you, we have the, uh, our new soil vapor extraction system. Kirtland Air Force Base and the mayor showing off their newest way to soak up millions of gallons of fuel that's been leaking on the base and spreading since the 1950s. The soil vapor system sucks the fuel out of the ground and then burns it up. The base was already using smaller versions of this system and they were showing success. So the Air Force brought in a bigger version that soaks up 17 times more fuel. It has the capacity to pump a, a lot more of the, uh, the fuel out of the ground quicker. It's estimated about 2 million gallons of fuel leaked into the subsurface through rusty underground pipes over several decades. The Air Force and City have been monitoring to make sure it hasn't reached the water people drink in the area. I drink the same water as the people that I serve and I want to make sure that the water coming out of that tap is safe to drink and it is. The Air Force has been working with the city, state and the feds to clean up the mess that has cost them millions. They say there's still a long way from being done. So while we're very uh, proud of this system, we think it's going to do great work in cleaning up the fuel. Uh, we know there's still a long ways to go, and we're committed to that for the long haul. That was Jessica got it there reporting. Now, the soil vapor extractor runs 24 hours a day and measures how much fuel it has burned.